Hey guys, Mixed Media Girl here. In today's video, we are going to be doing an alcohol ink vase. So this is a really simple technique. You're gonna start off with a piece of plastic wrap. It doesn't even matter if it's flat or not. And then take any alcohol ink colors that you want, and you're going to go ahead and just start kind of decorating it a little bit. Go fast because the alcohol inks can dry pretty quickly, but don't overdo it. You don't wanna to add too much and then have kind of a drippy pattern, and you do not need to cover the whole thing at all. We're just kind of creating little designs here. Feel free to use metallics. This is a purple metallic that I'm using, really pretty. And then I'm also going to be using a little bit of gold. Okay, once you're more or less happy with your design, go ahead and set your vase down in the middle of it. And then you're going to be pulling the plastic wrap up around the vase. Now, as you can probably see, this is not going to cover the whole vase and you're not trying to cover the whole vase necessarily, but if you want to, you can of course put more ink on your plastic wrap and cover more of the vase. So I'm just going around the vase and pressing my hand down to make sure that the color actually gets onto the vase. And then go ahead and slowly pull down the plastic wrap. alcohol ink is pretty transparent and you're going to get a gorgeous see-through vase. So go ahead and move it off to the side or at least off to a different section of the plastic wrap to dry. I typically will take it and flip it upside down so it can fully dry but just watch out for drips. If you have any you might want to take a little paper towel and just tap them gently. It doesn't look like I have any drips here. So I'm gonna go ahead and just let this dry. In terms of this alcohol ink here, you can go ahead and dip another vase if you want. You can also do this technique with wine glasses, or you can even let it dry and then reactivate it later with some isopropyl alcohol. So for now, we'll let this dry and then we'll come back and see how it looks then. Okay, so this ink dries very quickly. It's only been a couple minutes and this is already dry. Um, so I think this is gorgeous. It's got the different colors all the way around there. Obviously, it doesn't go up very high, but that's how I like it. So I just wanted to show you guys, while that one was drying, I actually did another one in the same piece of plastic wrap, but I added a little more ink so that it went up higher. So as you can see, this one just is, has a little bit more coverage. So a few things you could do if you want the ink to go up higher, just of course put more of it around on your plastic wrap. You can also take a piece of plastic wrap, put ink, and then just stick it wherever you want onto the vase. So it's pretty easy to control. Another great thing about this technique is if you hate it, just wash it with alcohol and start over. It's very easy to clean off. I do recommend sealing this with resin. Uh, otherwise, the ink will reactivate if any kind of liquid hits it. Another thing you can do though, if you wanna be super gentle and hand wash only very gently, is you can spray it with a Krylon Kamar varnish. So that's another one that's good for alcohol inks, but I recommend sealing it with resin. So have fun, use any colors that you want, try out different ways of doing this technique. 